though guys i'm so excited because now finally the box that i ordered on click and grow has arrived so um i bought like four different flowers that there's only one f um review on youtube that i watch regarding planting through the click and grow and they use flowers and and yeah so like i want to try a different one so that you could see if they will grow or not and so i picked this one and like i told also on the review that i mean in this video that they are pet friendly so they're okay to be eaten by your pets like cats or dogs but like it should be um you know everything has too much that good so just be careful for them not to eat much of this in case so yeah and then i also i saw like the pico pico like a small planter or like pot so i will i will also review on that so yeah just let me know if you want that as well to be reviewed but anyways i'll see a review on that but like so i bought like for the, the box so light because these are just plant pods so i bought four different um flowers there's no free <laughs> anyways so the first one is their um what do you call this sweet alison Sweet Alisum and then Balisum joke knife and then Calendula Calendula and then cornflower cornflower and coxcomb there you go so um I'm just gonna plant three First, three flowers the cornflower which is I read about the cornflower you can use it for tea if you want and then calendula has like um used for remedy for like um, inflammation like that I think I read yeah I think it's regarding inflammation or something you can research about calendula but this flower can also be eaten by humans and it has a good effect and actually for cats as well that I read too that um like for their tummy it, it can heal something when they're upset if their tummy's upset or something just let them eat a bit of this one and then it will heal their you know their tummy problems and the sweet alisu so what I'm thinking is um I'm going to uh put this because my favorite color is blue the cornflower on the facing it so left side on the middle is this sweet alisu and the the right side is the calendula and so i'm going to show you how to put them the pods inside and also like um picture by pictures i'm going to show you the update on how they will grow on my um on this tray or what they call i don't know like hydroponics device so yeah so this is where my um plant pad are like the this hydroponics click and grow is um is sitting so it's on my study table where i have my aquarium Xiaomi aquarium and this one for the shrimp i don't have ship currently but i'm gonna buy soon and then um, um, I'll open this one. Oh no, wait first. First, the calendula. So I'm going to take out the, the tray. And the pod tray. Remove this dome plastic. Another plastic. the lid and then here like you can put like i told also earlier 
that you can put names in here. But I don't think I need it. I only have three, so I know what I plant. And plus I record it here, so just in case I forget, I could just go back and watch. Oh. Because I think in this one, like it has a tape still, or like it's too sticky. So like, um, once you remove the first pod, because I'm not gonna use all of them. Then you can just close it back. So this is how it looks like inside. It's like again, it's the light or what? I don't know the light. But yeah, I'm gonna take it out. And I'll have to move more on the. So here it is. It's um. Maybe I'll put it here. Like it's dry, holding it. And then I don't see any hole. It looks like there's a hole in here, but there's no really hole. Like I think um, under is the seed and I don't want to touch it. So I'm gonna put it here. And then put this lead and then the dome. Dome, da, da, dome, 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 dome. And then I'm gonna put it back here. Then the next one, I'm gonna remove it. Again. Oh no, sweet Alison first. And then like, um, the, what do you call this? The, um, what's the name? The Pico. Oh, this one has a hole. The Pico is um, available. What do you call this? Available on Amazon.com, which is in the US. There's no, so I have to pay for the, um, what do you call that? For the custom thing. To be the different here, but. It's okay, at least I can. At least I can still have those. And I'm planning to put those here on my walls over here. I bought three. There, so we can close it back. This one. And then last is the coin flower. I wonder where's the coin. Just kidding. Anyways. First time I can see the seeds. What 
doesn't really focus. I don't know why. But, okay. Then it's straight. Then I feel that part on the very left side, water. Pardon me, there's like kids upstairs and they're like... Ah, like they're jumping, I don't know this hour but yeah here I did not boil the water by the way I just used this container oh you can't see it um, maybe I'll put this inside the plant so you can see like when when that thing in the middle which is the top then it means it's the water is full it's been so long this is like 1.7 liter of water Almost there. There. The reservoir has water. Ooh, reservoir has water now and it reaches the top. I messed up. It spilled some water. I'm just gonna wipe that up. So, yeah. So yeah, that's it. So I think about 1.5 liter to make um, to fill this up. And then once this goes down, like on the very edge, then it's time for you to water again. Or on the very, um, when it's like fixed down. So yeah. Thank you for watching my review on Click and Grow. I hope you like it. If you do, please like, click the notification bell so you get notified whenever I posted new videos. And yeah, see you next time. And have a good night, everyone. God bless.